legendary jazz musician Pete Fountain played his last performance at Hollywood Casino tonight in Bay St. Louis. Mr. Fountain has been playing at the casino regularly since 2003. Karen Abernathy was there for his farewell tonight to the Bay. Pete Fountain enjoys sharing his love for music with a live audience, and they love him. His fans and his love for the Gulf Coast area have kept this internationally known jazz icon coming back to Hollywood Casino week after week. It's home, you know. It's, it, this is my home away from home, you know, New Orleans here. Fountain has had a tremendous career since he started playing the clarinet 65 years ago. From 15 to 80, so that's just a long time. He became a household name after being on the Lawrence Welk Show in the 50s, and since then has played for four presidents and the Pope. He's also played with some of the best musicians around, ranging from Louis Armstrong to Harry Connick Jr. It's good. It's it's a good life, and I hope I hope I, I can still go on another about two years. I hope. <laughs> Still going strong, and while Fountain is leaving Hollywood Casino, he's not leaving the music he loves. At 80, he may be slowing down, but he's not ready to retire. I'll be, I'll be tooting, you know, not not that much, but uh, you know, I'll, I'll be tooting. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. That kind of says it all, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, as he said, you won't be able to keep that clarinet out of his hands, especially when Mardi Gras rolls around. Yeah, one of the great musicians of all time right there. Mm -hmm. Thanks for